All right, this is the LC display. I took it off of a AT&T phone, and it just happens to be um, to have a driver for a Hitachi um, 44780, I believe. I know that right. Anyway, it uh, it has 14 leads that go in. It has a four four lead bus um, serial input, and I'm using a 16F628 uh, PIC microcontroller and uh, basically the only other things out there are in there are a couple of resistors and uh, a 20 kilo ohm pot to control the uh, brightness of the display. Up here is the program. This is basically the LCD out demo program with a bunch of stuff added. Um, it's funny because the it's a 1x by 16 character display and apparently it's in two memory areas so you can't just do text um, for the 16 characters so if I do greetings human I actually have to do greeting to load up the first eight characters and then I have to do um, dollar sign fe dollar sign c0 which uh, in the 16x by two lines, uh, 2x16. Um, the other LCD LCD display I have um, that would actually print to the second line, but this prints to the second um, group of eight characters. So it's actually two two groups of eight characters. Um, so that's that's what I would do there for the LCD out. Now the next thing I'm going to show is uh, I'm going to try to click the mouse here. So, on the, uh, this is the uh, IC Prog. Uh, this is what I actually program the PIC with. And uh, you see the programs there. It's a 16F628. I have to set the configuration for the oscillator to INTRC I slash O. The code protect is off. And uh, I have to put just a check next to the PWRT. Otherwise, I uh, haven't, haven't had a whole lot of luck programming it. There's no external oscillator on the uh, micro pick that I'm using right now. Uh, I'm sorry, the pick 16F628 that I'm using right now. I'm using the internal oscillator. So, uh, it's working pretty good.